A dog from Elliott, Maine is up for some national recognition. You will probably recognize him as well. Forrest the Great Dane is a candidate in the Pet Partners Pet of the Year competition. If you scan that QR code right there, you can learn more about the candidates and the competition itself. Now, Forrest is a therapy dog who helps a variety of people from soldiers to students. This fundraising competition goes until March 18th. The winner gets announced March 19th and the money raised will support Pet Partners. It's an organization that registers therapy animals. One of the places Forrest goes is to the Dempsey Center in South Portland. I got the chance to see him helping patients and their families back in September. Okay. There you go. Here, come here. Every Thursday, this Great Dane named Forrest walks into the South Portland location of the Dempsey Center, ready to offer 160 pounds of cuddle therapy. He's one of five so-called Dempsey dogs. When people come into the Dempsey Center, you know, they have a lot going on in their life. They're either in active treatment, they're coming out of treatment, they're caring for somebody who is in active treatment. And that chance for them to just take a break and enjoy the time with a Dempsey dog is incredible. And you can, you can see it on their face, you can see it on their body, their shoulders relaxing, and it's just really beautiful to see. Forrest comes in and waits for anyone who might need a snuggle after some acupuncture or just a quiet shoulder to lean on in counseling. I just think dogs have that sense. There was a little boy that sat with him, with him while his mother was getting a massage or something. And for a whole hour, this little boy sat with Forrest on the floor. And um, he just relaxes and gets in it. Tina Buckley has been bringing Forrest in for two years. Before that, she knew very little about the Dempsey Center. My initial thought was it's going to be kind of a gloomy place, and it couldn't be more different. I've seen some amazing things. I mean, there's... One woman that would get down on the floor with him and wrap her arms around him while her husband was getting acupuncture. And on this day, just moments after our interview, we were lucky enough to meet that woman. Met Forrest in 2022. Uh, my husband and I were coming in for, for counseling. Pam Hurd lost her husband, Herbie, earlier this year. And while they both utilized the services at the Dempsey Center before, she continues the counseling, but never alone, scheduling her appointments around Forrest's visits. It brings me peace knowing that um, it's just something about a dog. You can sit on the floor and rub him and there's there's no expectations. The Dempsey Dog Program has had so much great feedback from clients that it continues to grow, including an Australian Shepherd, a Bernadoodle, Poodle, and Bull Mastiff. They visit hospitals, the centers, the retreats, even the Dempsey Challenge, making quick, quiet contact or long-lasting connections. He holds all the secrets, all my secrets, huh? On my good days and not so good days. Somebody said the icing on the cake was to be able to sit and visit with Forrest. And that, that kind of made me happy. Because I just don't feel like it's a huge thing for me. I just show up with my dog. But then when I hear stuff like that, it just, you know, when somebody says, you made my day. And it's such a simple thing to do. Such important work with these therapy dogs, too, and what their handlers do. Right, and that's the other part of the story, obviously, is the people there with the dogs. Mm -hmm. Of course, yeah. we are rooting for Forrest. The competition goes through the middle of March.